the president didn't join in any chant like that. And if you're going to claim the president having a battle over a socialist issue and the socialist Democrats, that's one that he has taken up even in the State of the Union. He promised that this country will never have socialism here. And that's why he's fighting so hard. And I think it's really wrong that you would even challenge this president when you look at the first lady is foreign born as well. So I think it, the question is out of base. Yes. Well, Kevin McCarthy there defending the president. Now, he says he didn't watch it. Well, a lot of us watched it. The president did call out these congresswomen by name, very specifically. Jane Horman, we were just talking about the Merriam Webster uh, most, most searched words last night. And they were in order racism, socialism, fascism, concentration camp, xenophobia, and bigot. <laughs> Now, first of all, none of these members of Congress are socialists, but that is the way the Republican leadership wants to frame this election face-off. They don't have a Democrat to run against. They're not running against Bernie Sanders, per se, yet. And there's not a single member of these Congress uh, rep congressional representatives who are avowed socialists. So I, I don't know where that is coming from other than opposition research. 